Hey, what's up, everybody? This, about, this, this topic today is about the Big Show and his career in the WWE. Now, I'm not going to talk. I'm not going to talk about his WCW career when he was the Giant back in WCW. He was um he was a former WCW World Heavyweight Champion, though I know that much. But the Big Show debuted on St. Valentine's Day Massacre in '99 trying to help Vince McMahon win a cage match against Stone Cold Steve Austin. He threw Stone Cold into the cage and caused Vince to match because the door opened up and Stone Cold won, giving him a shot at the title at WrestleMania 15. Now, the Big Show, his first year in, in, in the WWE, he became the WWE Champion. He defeated Triple H on the Rock in a triple threat match at Survivor Series in 99, then lost the belt a month later to Triple H. Big, the Big Show... He actually main evented WrestleMania 16 in a fatal four-way match with Mick Foley, The Rock, and Triple H, which was a terrible WrestleMania. But The Big Show has main evented one WrestleMania. He has been a hardcore champion, been a tag team champion, and he was the very first wrestler to hold the ECW, WWE, and WCW champion. And I, I, don't, I don't mean holding them all at once, but he's had all three belt. He's had history of all holding all three belts before. The Big Show, um, he's never won a World Rumble. Um, after his after like you know a little while, the Big Show kind of went down the chain a little bit. He um, he had rivalries with um, I mean he did end Brock Lesnar's winning streak. He was the very first person to pin Brock Lesnar. He beat Brock Lesnar at Survivor Series in the year two thousand and two. He was jobbing for a while, became the champion, then lost to Kurt Angle a month later. The Big Show, he um, he was he was also a United States champion, an Intercontinental champion. He defeated uh, who did he defeat for the United States championship? I forgot who it was. Oh, uh, Eddie Guerrero. Yeah, he defeated Eddie Guerrero for the United States championship, and then lost it to John Cena at WrestleMania 20. Um, the Big Show, he left for a while in the year 2004, came back and destroyed the whole locker room in a segment. Which led on to a Kurt Angle versus Big Show rivalry. The Big Show, he um, he's he's lost a lot of times at WrestleMania. He um, he's beaten Cody Rhodes at WrestleMania. He's won a tag match at WrestleMania, and he's now won the Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal at WrestleMania. He was also in a World Championship match at WrestleMania 25 with Edge and John Cena, which John Cena won that match and became the World Heavyweight Champion. The Big Show, um, uh, I'm just saying, you know, he's a good heel, but seeing him win the belt, it was like TLC, he beat Mark Henry, then Mark Henry, um, did the World Strongest Slam to him, and Daniel Bryan cashed money in the bank, making Mark Big Show only hold the title for not as long, <laughs> you know, but, um, the Big Show, they make a joke out of the Big Show, Daniel Bryan actually pinned the Big Show on SmackDown, what I'm trying to say is, the Big Show's had some success Yet, he's also been looking like a jobber his whole career and looking terrible. He, he's big, he's huge, he could probably take a lot of people. But they make him look so weak. I mean, the Big Show shouldn't lose, you know. I remember he had a match with Floyd Mayweather at WrestleMania 24, I believe, and Floyd Mayweather won that match hitting him with brass knuckles to the face. But the Big Show in his career, was it a joke? Was it a shame? Does he had success? Do people not realize the success he's had? Because they look at how bad he did at WrestleMania, or look at the title reigns he had. You know, he was a, he's he's held on. He's been a world champion maybe three or four times. He beat Triple H for the title. He defeated Brock Lesnar for the title. He defeated Sheamus for the title. That's all I can really think of for now. But I think his career was okay, but could have been better. They could have used him better. But that's my thoughts on the Big Show and his WWE career. Give me your thoughts. Was his career a joke? Was he a um, was has he had more success than you think? What are your thoughts on the Big Show? That's all. That's all I want to say about him. That's my opinion. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Subscribe if you want to. And bye.